Welcome back to the episode of the George Henson Outdoors. Today I'm going to be doing a goose call video on the Tim Grounds for a Super Mad Goose Call. Um, you guys are supposed to look here. This is a bird's eye maple goose call. Um, that's what it looks like. Um, so it has a bird's, it's bird's eye maple, which is wood, with a, I'm not sure exactly what brand this, what band this is. Excuse me. Um, so here, I wanted to wait until I got to get a feel for this call, you know, calling it a little bit and practice with it before I gave you guys a review on it. You know, I thought about doing a review right out of the box when I first got it, but I wanted to, you know, make sure that, it was, yeah, I wanted to have like an honest view, you know, you know, cause I could give a bad review saying that because I'm not used to calling this, I'm used to a completely different call. I could give a bad review or I could give a good review just because I was, I mean, like, super excited about it, you know, just thinking, oh, I don't know. You know what I mean? Yeah, I just give a you know, not really biased review. But, um, yeah, so I practiced on it a lot um, throughout the past weekish. I think I got it maybe, not, 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 I got it maybe Wednesday or Thursday. So I had it for less than a week, and I really like it so far. Um, it's deep and goosey, you know, so good for early season big geese but it can also get really loud too with the honks and stuff i mean I, it's a good all-around call in my opinion um i wouldn't recommend buying it as your first call obviously you know, i would recommend going with a polycarbonate call instead of a wood call or an acrylic call i want to say that all the time in all my geese calling videos but yeah so now here i'll give you guys um a little sound file of it run down what it sounds like it looks like when it's taken out um there's the reed and gut system for this call um just like that there you go so um pretty solid call i think um it's definitely going to stay on my lanyard for probably forever um yeah so here i'll just give you guys a comparison of how deep it is compared to my 90 by nature so i'll do a whole clock in like a moon i guess so Watch how deep that call is, and here's how high pitch my naughty by nature is. Just so you can see the differences in sounds between these two calls. So, um, 
um, I shouldn't be able to, as you, I honestly should be able to tell, this hole's way deeper, so I really like that, you know. It's a good competition call. Um, the Pro Super Mag is actually Hunter Ground's um, call of choice when he's competition calling, which he can't anymore because he won the uh, Champion of Champions. So he's not competition call anymore, but this was his call of choice back when he did. So um, Hunter hand turns all these calls. You get a water and a curly call. The hand turned by Hunter, hand tuned by Hunter. Um, the customer service is great over Tim's grounds. I emailed Hunter a bunch. He replied all the, every every email. I think he replied to me. Um, but really helpful, you know. I asked him about like what call I should get and that stuff, you know. So if you if you want to, you know, talk to him, he's a really good guy to talk to. So um, just go over to Tim Grounds' website, and then you can find the number that you can call Hunter, or you can email him to get a hold of him. Either way, he's still gonna reply. And um, yeah, he's a really nice guy. You know, he knows what he's talking about too. You know, if you explain him your calling style, you know, what you like in the call, what call you have now, you know, what call you're looking at. If you think it's, if he thinks it's a good choice, he'll let you know what he thinks, which is um, probably a pretty good judgment. So yeah. Um, so just be on the lookout for our apparel company coming. Me and Nathan. Um, it's going to be unguided waterfowl. Um, yes, I don't know if we put to the name yet. We told him. We told a couple people already. We have our logo and everything. Um, we're going to start selling just hoodies, I believe, for the start. So, um, DM us on Instagram. My Instagram is Henson underscore outdoors. Nathan is NT underscore outdoors, I believe. And then our Instagram is unguided underscore waterfowl for our company. So you can DM us on any of those Instagrams. Um, I'm not sure exactly what Nathan's is, but you can DM us on any three of those you would like to know more about it. Um, see pictures of the hoodie, possibly. So we can maybe show you that. I'm not sure if we're that far yet that we want to release that. Um, but if you want to buy one, obviously, let us know. We'll get your order so we can know how many we need to get made. Um, what else? Hit, please like, subscribe, comment on this video. More video suggestions. Someone, um, I'm not sure his name. I think it was Nathaniel Campbell. I think that was his name. Commented and said that he wants to see a scouting video on how to scout for waterfowl. That video will be coming. Um, I tried filming when we were scouting the other day, but we couldn't do that. Unfortunately, did not get a yes on any field. So it was kind of, you know, I, and I didn't really want to film it while I was out, you know, and show you guys birds on a field that I couldn't hunt. So I'm probably going to end up filming it here or another day on scouting after we do get permission. Um, so yeah, we should have a podcast getting started here soon. We have all sorts of ideas that we need to do. But the apparel company will definitely be out by the end of 2019, I'm saying. Hopefully we should start getting some orders and taking stuff in the next month. That's what we're hoping. I'm um, going you know, to finish up our designs and finish up what we want on the hoodie so I can show people. Yeah, that's basically it for this video. Um, thank you for watching. See you guys in the next one.